Okay, uh, let's take a look at our map again. Yeah, I guess this thing is just keeping track of our trip. I don't know. Yeah, um, man, unfortunately, I am still absolutely baffled as to what the heck, how the heck I'm supposed to get to the hinterlands. I see these places here. Hey, the hinterlands! Okay. Alright, so do I just go there? Travel to location. Let's go to the hinterlands. Screw it. Let's go. Oh, I get to take my people with me. Uh, well, of course. Farrick, Cassandra, and Solus. How many do I get to take? Do I get to take all of them? Let's take them all. I don't care if you guys are busy. You're coming with me. Come along. We have the hinterlands to visit. The first inquisition, the birth of the Chantry, took place more than nine ages ago. The mists of time have obscured once well-known facts. It is commonly believed the Chantry alone created the Templars in the circle of Ma Mag... Magi? Oh my god, I don't know how to say that. I know what it means, I don't know how to say it. Few recall there was ever an inquisition. Those who do believe it predated the Chantry. Hunting cultists and mages in a, in a reign of terror, ending only upon its transformation into the Templar Order. This is not quite the truth. One must keep in mind the state of Thetis prior to the Chantry's creation, a world where the only source of order, the Teventer Imperium, had fallen apart. People blamed magic for the death of Andraste, the blight, the terror they saw every day, and not without reason. Abominations and demons rampaged the countryside. No one was safe. Desperate groups of men and women initially formed the Seekers of Truth, determined to re-establish order, because no one else would do what was necessary. The truth they sought, the question they tried to answer, was how to restore sanity in a world gone mad. Wow, this is a lot. Was theirs a reign of terror? Perhaps. Evidence suggests they were as vigilant in their protection of mages as they were of regular people. When they intervened, they convened an ad hoc trial to... To be continued. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know if it was if it's possible to read all that that quickly. And why did it have to make it disappear? It's still loading. of Andraste. I've heard the stories. Everyone has. We know what you did at the breach. It's an honor to meet you, my lord. Inquisition Scout Harding, at your service. I, well, all of us here, will do whatever we can to help. <laughs> Harding, huh? Ever been to Kirkwall's high town? I can't say I have. Why? You'd be Harding and I... No, <laughs> never mind. Ugh. <laughs> Ah, pleased to meet you. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. We should get to business. The situation's pretty dire. We came to secure horses from Redcliffe's old horse master. I grew up here, and people always said that Dennett's herds were the strongest and the fastest this side of the Frostbacks. But with the Mage Templar fighting getting worse, we couldn't get to Dennett. Maker only knows if he's even still alive. Mother Giselle's at the crossroads helping refugees and the wounded. Our latest reports say that the war's spread there, too. Corporal Vale and our men are doing what they can to help protect the people, but... they won't be able to hold out very long. You best get going. No time to lose. Okay. Uh, let's see, they're supposed to f close two Fade Rifts. They're supposed to establish six camps. 
We're supposed to speak with Dennett. Anything else you want me to do while I'm here? Okay, uh, so I can't talk to my party here. Equip potions. Do I want to equip potions? <laughs> oh my gosh. All I wanted to do was walk over here. I'm, I, I, I don't know. I'm playing too many games at the same time. Uh, regeneration potion. Uh, restores 26 health every 2 seconds for 60 seconds. Okay. Oh, it says 0 of 5, though. Um. Oh, okay. I, I guess I have three of these now. Alright, cool. Put those in my potion belt. What's this? Varric. Hey, Varric, why don't you take some of these, too? Oh, actually, I probably can't. He probably can't carry any because I, I used up all the parties. Um. Elfruits. Okay, so sorry. Uh, and if you want to remove it to stinking bad, it's there now. Tough luck. Tough luck, you can't remove it. Alright. Hey, I completed a quest. I missed, mixed a potion. Nice. That was easy. Alright, so let us take a look at the map here. Uh, right here we've got the requisition officer. Here we've got... I guess this is where the Threat Remains mission is. Here is a rift. Here is a rift. And here's a place for a camp, and here's a place for a camp. Well, we'll just go here since we're closest to it. It's a good a reason as any, right? Uh, if I could find him. Is he down this hill here? What the? Oh, is that him? Oh. Okay, report. What is it? Could prove useful, sir. Uh, hinterlands field tent requisition. They need some lamb's wool and silk. Nothing to report, sir. Okay. All right. Well, um, yeah. Okay, great. Let's. Uh, okay, so this is a camp that's already been established, I imagine. Rest. Okay, I could rest if I wanted to. No need to rest. Oh, what was that right there? Change party. No, I don't want to do that. Equip potions. Inspect requisitions. I really don't like how you have to like get so close to something in order to activate it. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, we need silk. And, whoa, back. And we need uh, a logging stand and some iron. Yeah, I'm going to remember all that. Let's see here. Let us take a look. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, my whole party can level up? Is that what it was trying to tell me? Is that what it was trying to tell me? How do I do it? No. Um. Huh. Yeah, all these guys have little arrows that show up. Okay, how do I, um... How do I upgrade them? How do I level up? He's a level 3 mage. I have two points to spend. These are spirits. Masters of this school of magic call upon spirits for protection, as well as the essence of the fate itself. Their spells disrupt hostile magic, Create defensive barriers, and even heal injuries. Okay. So that's like a cleric kind of thing. Storm, masters of this school of magic, call forth the power of thunder and lightning. Their spells paralyze foes and arc from one enemy to another. Inferno, masters of this school of magic, dominate the battlefield with unrelenting fire. Enemies who survive the initial blast are driven mad with terror or burned to death in unquenchable flames. Winter, masters of this school of magic, summon cold that bites deeper than the cruelest winter. Their icy spells slow and weaken enemies. So, is this the stuff that he already has? So it looks like he's already got these two, and it would explain why I saw enemies being frozen so many times. Yeah. So I'm going to guess that this guy... Well, okay, he's uh, got something from the school of winter. And he also has something 
from the school of spirit barrier. Um, what I want is some kind of health, you know, peaceful aura. Makes enemies less likely to attack you in battle. Guardian spirit protect. What about what about health? I mean, I want I want somebody who could heal my party. Revival, rejuvenating barrier. That's just mana and stamina. How do I how do I heal somebody? What a huh? Peaceful aura. I don't know, man. Barrier. Huh. I find it odd that um, the description of this mentions healing injuries, but um, I don't see anything. Let's do this one. A particular barrier springs into place around you automatically when you are barely injured. A barrier provides an additional health bar that must be destroyed before the target will take any damage. Barrier is vulnerable to spell. Okay, let's let's try that. Okay, I'm going to apply that. How come it didn't show up? Okay. Oh, maybe I have to put it in a slot? Okay, I don't know. And uh, let's go over to this one since he's already... I'm going to... I'm just going to pretend... The, <laughs> pretend. Play like he is in the School of Winter because he already has a winter thing, so... Let's see, the next thing would be Fade Step. You let invisible waves of magic carry you forward, blurring ahead a short distance. Uh-huh. Mana Surge, your barrier explodes into wild magic when enemies destroy it. The blast freezes all nearby enemies and allows you to cast your next spell without consuming mana. That sounds cool. Alright. Okay. I still don't understand why it's not showing up in my little thing here. All right, so um, I guess I uh, I guess he's leveled up now. Um, whoops, I don't remember what button I pressed. Right, huh? There we go. Okay, so we'll we'll switch to Cassandra. Cassandra. Um, she's got shield wall, challenge, and payback strike. And these, two of these at least, are under weapon and shield. Shield wall, payback strike. And one of them is under... Oh, actually I don't know what it's under because it's purple. It's under this one. Under Vanguard. War cry. Trust the steel. Uh, charging bull. Man, I don't know what to pick. I'm not really sure what to do with her. She's a warrior. Let's see what's next under this. Warriors resolve you fight all the harder when you're hurting. Gaining stamina when you lose health. Stamina restored 10% for every 10% health lost. Is that a good thing to have? Bear mauls the wolves using techniques perfected by Orlesian Chevaliers. You can't be flanked by enemies and you're less likely to be staggered when hit from the front. Turn the bolt. Your expertise with a shield protects you against range attacks from the front. Um, eh, let's do that one. I don't know. And shield bash or lunge and slash. That sounds like fun. We'll do that one. As you can see, I really have no strategy here. Which is, you know, just horrible. Varric. He is also a rogue like me. He has the same things I do, I think. Longshot and Caltrops. Because I'm pretty sure those are the same things I have. I have Longshot and, and Stealth. Okay. 